we have prepared long and hard for this moment. As Ethiopia's army sat, sets on the border of Egypt. It is time. Hello everyone, and welcome to the invasion of Egypt. Today is the day that it's going to happen. So, shall we just get right on it? I mean, we, we should just not bullshit around about it. Let's just, uh, Egypt, your uh, final warning for your imperial aggression against uh, no one in particular. I want to see actually what kind of weapons you have before I declare war. Nothing, 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 nothing. You have nothing. You have really have absolutely sweet fuck all to defeat me with. So, we've got, still got tons in reserve. Do so. We've got plenty. We'll do defeat and no bother at all. Right, so, shall we get on with it, guys? Shall we? Because their people are basically screaming out for peace and stability and hope. Let's get this shit done. So, first of all, the plan is we are going to be putting in some recon spies into Egypt. I'm going to want one here, and I'm going to want one here. There we go. We'll have another one here, just to kind of have a look around, see where the enemy is. Because I don't want them sneaking up on us. I don't know where they're going to be when we invade. So it looks like they've got tanks, but what kind of tanks are they? Like, they look like World War II tanks to me, so... It doesn't look like it's going to cause that much of an infantry there, so... I think we're fine, guys. In terms of firepower and weapons, we're gonna defeat them. We're gonna crush them to bits. It's gonna be terrific. Right, so... Let's get on with it. Let's... Go! We're now at war with Egypt. At last, it's finally happening. So, first of all, we're gonna be sending in our... Beagles. We're gonna send in our Beagles into their uh, closest... Weapons divisions. Which are probably going to be actually be these that place there because you can see there's a barracks there, so there'll be uh, people coming out of there. So also, is this the? Uh, yeah, it's a transport plane. So we're going to send these guys up to here first, and these guys to here. Rocket artillery close behind here, and we will send these. I don't know what we're going to do with these guys because I, I was I was kind of wanting them to go up this way, but our, our infantry here can be, pretty much deal with it. And since we've got no supply, they've got no supply here our territory will creep up slowly onto them, so it'll be fine. And these guys can just slowly make their way through the desert, letting our stuff catch up to them. So let's see, also, let's put some... Let's, let's fly over our whips as well into this territory, so they're not going to surprise us with any dreadful aircraft. So yeah, that's what we're going to do. Right, now let's move the... Let's move uh, our troops over into the uh, Egyptian coast. So we'll move them here. And that should give us plenty of space to maneuver. Uh, we're not going to use our nukes yet. I know you guys are going to be shouting, "No, why are you not using your nukes?" I was like, "But we 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 have to avoid pissing everyone off." So we'll use our nukes later if we if it all goes tits up. So we'll also send these guys over here to capture this airbase quickly. So let's get going, guys. Let's do this. It is time to go to war. Doo -doo -doo. Good. Our beagle bombers are taking uh, are taking out the uh, enemy over here. That's good stuff. Right, and now we're slowly making our way into their territory. We've got our uh, ships taking over the coastline. That's good, that's good, that's good. And now we're going to park our submarines in the Suez Canal Zone. So any Egyptian ships that come through will be absolutely crushed by our advanced submarines. And we'll send the Gulfs up too. I'll tell you what, we'll put them over here, I reckon. So yeah, we'll put them there and that'll do for that. Our spies are seeing troop movement coming in from the north, but that's fine. We won't need to worry about that. We'll also put these guys over here. So then these guys will sweep round like that. Oh, we've got uh, infantry coming over here. Yeah, these, uh, these are going to be unedited videos, by the way. So uh, just be prepared, for, uh, be prepared for a long haul video. So there we go. And these, my whips are coming in and just dropping off. My ways even are dropping off guys onto here. Brilliant. So now we've captured this airbase. Uh, what our garrison, we haven't taken that much damage, which is great. Uh, and our beagle bombers are slowly taking out these guys here, so that's good. Now we can land our beagles here and use them and stuff. Wait, wait, Note the airbase is in full, is intact, so that's kind of good. So we can work with that now. Let's keep these guys on the road. Let's move you up here and we'll move you up here. And we'll move our whips up. Oh, good, we've actually got an airbase down here too, so that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Right, and we're going to move our rocket artillery up further up the road as well. We'll move you here. Yeah, cool. And we'll get you guys to go up here now. Let's see, our whips are currently... Oh, we're, so they're sitting here now, so that's okay. Tell you what, have we got any... No, we haven't actually got any foreign aircraft in our uh, 
in our field of view, so we won't have to worry about that for now. Uh, I wonder if I could do an amphibious invasion of um, Egypt, actually. Probably could. Oh, that's a thought. We'll send our, we'll send the last of our um, mountain infantry over to this port over here, so it's so oh, out of stuck in supplies. Oh, someone's declared war on us. Oh, that's the Suez Canal zone. Okay, that's fine. I thought it was a foreign power that decided to declare war on us. That's cool. That is okay. And that means now we're going to send our patrol craft uh, to go take over the Suez Canal zone. So there we go. We'll just send a detachment of our ships into the Suez Canal zone and completely take them over. Right, you guys get in there. Have you got any fuel left? You have plenty of fuel. Why are you just hanging around? Oh, wow, you're slow. Jeezy peeps. Right, okay, so the Suez Canal zone is now under our control, which is good stuff. Good, good stuff. One, two, three, four, five, six. Put you there, and we'll put you guys there. Now we've got these guys completely locked down. There's no way they can get through the uh, canal zone to get to us, and our army is too strong for them to actually take us out, so we just got to worry about... There we go, there's these guys here, look. So they're actually not going to do that much damage, I don't think. I think they're just an infantry... Yeah, light infantry. So we've got these guys here. We'll send them up against them. So that'll work in our favour there. I don't actually think we're going to really need to worry about this over here. Because if they do come over, we can just bomb them with our whips and uh, bombers, funnily enough. Right, so let's keep these guys moving. We'll keep them moving up this way. It looks like we're going to actually have to resupply them with our carriages. There we go. So we'll set you on air patrol for now to resupply our troops over there. So there we go. Right, they'll walk in and they'll keep them supplied. You get back to base. Good, good. So they've. I, I actually wondered if, if I switched the initiative off for these guys, would they actually go back to base? Uh, and it turns out they do, so that's okay. Right, so how much of the Suez Canal Zone have we got to take over? Not much, actually. Uh, but I like having a large area for me. Like, if they have to come through this small zone here, it means that they're not going to have much... We're not going to have much of a problem defending against them, so that's cool. Right, so what about our ways? Are they on our way down? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if they're on their way down. They might be, they might not be. They might just be taking the piss. Right, so we've also got these guys there, so you guys go there. And move up this direction here. And you guys go there, and... Do, 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 do. Mountain infantry, you got there. There we go, now we're slow... We're going to close off this area here, hopefully capture this bit here, and then it'll just kind of move its way up as they run out of supplies. So that's fine. It shouldn't take too long to actually to invade Egypt. Uh, I thought they had a lot more troops than this, but it turns out they don't. Right. Also, we've got this. these guys in reserve. We don't need to worry about them going up that way, so we'll just move you guys there. There we go. And... yes, everything's going nicely. They've got infantry coming down from the north, but that's not going to matter. Oh, there's some fighting going on. Here we go. It's our light infantry versus theirs. And our, of course, our APCs won the day with no bother at all. First proper battle between Egyptian forces and... Ethiopian forces, apart from this place over here, which we're not talking about that. Uh, where's my last beagle? One of my beagles has disappeared. Where is my beagle? Is it going back to base? I'm worried now. Where's my beagle? Beagle? Where's my beagle? I want my beagle back. Where's my beagle? I want my baby back. No. Uh, right, let's see. Oh, that's a thought. We can send air carriage over to here, air patrol, to go there. That will resupply those gents over there. Have these guys got fuel? They, got, I, they have. Good, good, good. Now what we'll do is we'll split these guys over, and we'll put them into detachments of two and move them, splay them out over the t enemy territory, so it will capture more ground. And we have you there, and you guys just move up like that. There we go. That will capture more territory for us, and you guys can do the same and just kind of soak up all these little bits of land. Right now we need our tanks to start moving in. Actually, you can move over there. I don't know why. Oh, there we go. There's the beagle. Oh, man, he got damaged in battle. God damn it. Right, okay, tell you what, you go and... Uh, where is it? Repair down here. There we go. Right, who's under attack? There's something under attack there. I heard something there. I don't think it really matters, but... Right, so, we've got the beagles coming down over here. We've got these guys coming over down over here, so we'll just send our bombers after them. There we go. How much damage do our bombers do? Quite a bit. It's a good amount of damage that they do. Oh. We're gonna need, oh wow, we're, yeah, we're gonna need our supplies to get sorted pretty soon. We're gonna need, oh, no, 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 where are you going? Right, so we're gonna move you guys up there, like here and here. Actually, no, 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 you guys go there, yeah. And you guys go there. Yeah, see, the problem is, is uh, I've not actually got a good enough supply craft to 
uh, keep these guys from losing their supply zones. That's the problem I've always had with this game is you kind of expand, if you expand too quickly you're bound to lose out on uh, some uh, supplies. So that's a problem, but we can fix it, we can fix it, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Territory lost due to supply, I know. It's fine, it's fine. Right, so you guys have split out, that's good, so you keep moving up here, you move up there, and you move up there. Just hang them as well. Nope. And up a doop a doop a doop a doop a doop a doop there we go. You guys move up there. Okay, cool. How's our, how's our finance doing? It's not that bad, our trade's gone down, but that's only because we're declaring war, so it's fine. It's fine, guys. Seriously, it's fine. Shh. It's fine. Okay, you got your thing, you get in there. Oh, there comes our tanks. Oh, wow, there are men in infantry fought their tanks off, no bother at all. Bloody hell's bells. You guys are good at your job. Right, keep running forward, guys. Come on. Right, keep this on the road. I'll tell you what we'll do, actually. We'll send the beagles after the, that tank over there just to finish it off. Get stuck in beagles. There we go. I think I'll take it out. Yeah. Well, the wall, but it'll sit. It'll put it down. Little thing. Ooh. I hear artillery. Where's that artillery coming from? Was that what I think it was? Ooh, that could have actually been um, transport craft coming from over here now. It might be. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Right. So, have you captured that yet? No, you haven't. Right. Get stuck in, guys. Come on. And. Five, six, seven, and you guys move up there, and you guys move up there. This will secure this area for us as well. So, do, do, and do, do. see, uh, you might notice as well that the artillery ran away the second that they couldn't. Um, what do you call it? They couldn't uh, hold the territory. Basically, what it means is, is that artillery can't capture territory. Only offensive units can capture territory. So, indirect f weapons can't actually do any uh, terrain capture. So. It just has to be something we can't do. <laughs> right. Have you guys moved to your position? Yes, you have. You move there, you move there, and you move there. I'll tell you what, you move up there. There we go. And you secure in between there before next tick. Because when it ticks over, we'll lose territory again. It's basically, it's like every time that ticks down, it goes, have you got enough supply in this area? No, you don't. Keep going. Right. You guys go up there. Secure the road. Come on. Secure the road. Go, 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 go. Yeah, there we go. That road's now secured for us. Our glorious empire of Ethiopia. I'll tell you what, you guys go down there as well so that we don't lose that bit. Right, you, you're just sitting on the border of that little bit there going, yeah, yes, there we go, we captured that. Brilliant. Okay, so now we've captured that. So let's move these tanks up here and we'll let them refuel over here. We'll let everyone regroup now since we're now slaying. Yep, there we go. We didn't lose that much territory this time. So that's good. Right, so you guys get back to base. Actually, no, wait. We've got a new airfield. You get to there. And you guys get to there. There we go. Now, what have we got to deal with now? We've got our ways that we need to use for transporting our guys over here now, so it should be fine. No, nothing's actually coming down the Suez Canal Zone, which I'm surprised about. Usually you would see a lot of things coming down the Suez Canal Zone, like just infantry and things, but I don't think they have any. Is invading Egypt actually going to be as difficult as I thought it was? Probably not. Right, let's see. I'm only keeping you guys here just in case they try and invade down here. I kind of want to send some recon craft after them, but I don't think I have any. Never mind. Right, let's get you guys, let's get the MiG Fox Bats further up. We've got an airbase further up now. Do -do -do -do. Yes, we do. We'll put you guys here. And you guys can work from there. There, come on. Fox Bats, there they go. Right, so now you guys can work from there. Oh wow, our, our money's actually going up. It's not that bad. Uh, what's our GDP compared to them as well? Ah, it's half of ours, but we can deal with that. How many people have you got on your territory? 23 million. That's going to be a nice introduction into uh, extra to our glorious nation's GDP. Right, so you guys there, you go there, you go there. there you go. Now, these guys are running out of supplies, but that's fine because we can send... Where are you, where are you, where are you? You're there. Right, send two carriages over there to resupply. You guys go on air patrol there, and you guys go on air patrol here. I think when it works on hex-based stuff, I think anything that's there, if it supplies there, it'll supply around it in a hex. Or you might have to be on top of it, but they'll fly over them anyway, because they they circle around that area. So yeah, you'll see. Okay, we'll, set, we'll keep sending our mountain infantry up. Tell you what, we'll use these ways to actually uh, take this port over here now. There we go. You guys take that port. And we'll move our mountain infantry further up to this town here. And we'll send our other infantry up here on an offensive. So there we go. I think maybe we've got enough fuel. So No, we don't. We have no way have enough fuel. 
Okay, you guys can just stay there then for now. Now, how are you doing for fuel? You're halfway there. Well, we on it. No. Uh, you can go here and protect our troops' flanks, and you can sit here. There we go. Right, so you can move through there. Do, 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 do. We're just moving uh, troops around now, making sure we don't lose any supplies on. So that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. What else are we going to do? It's looking quite good so far. I mean, I'm not encountering much resistance, but then it is just uh, African nation. What the fuck are you doing? Where are you going? What are you doing? Why are you doing it? And how? What are you doing it? Right, I'll tell you what, actually. Just move to there. Just move your ways. Just move that fat way to there. There we go, to capture that territory. And we'll let you resupply just there for now. Five, six, seven. Tell you what, you move there. And once they've resupplied, we'll move you guys there and we'll start moving them around. That's cool, and our recon guys are showing it. Actually, tell you what, we'll move our recon guys now. Move our recon guys further up. Recon there and there and tell you what I'll put I'll put a guy in the capital as well not near the capital I misclicked there okay so have you guys got fuel yes you do excellent right you can move there you can move there you can move there and now you guys can regroup over here on this time and you guys can do the same next the time there we go there we go, right, have you still, no, yeah, you've not got any fuel, bollocks, right, let's tell you what, you guys all finish there, and you two carriages, air patrol over there, okay. you don't actually have to set them on a resupply as well, which is good, so you, you can just kind of make them patrol in a random area, so that, well, not a random area, a set area, so that, like, they'll just keep going back and forth this area until these guys are fully resupplied, so. Oh, first, a new battle over here. Garrison forces. Yeah, the garrison forces are completely overwhelmed compared to our uh, improved infantry that we got. I mean, these aren't even the best ones that we're... We're currently building these new ones, if you remember rightly, as well. So, we've got plenty of troops that we can use. And we've got plenty... We've got enough. We've got loads, guys. Oh, here come some guys. So, we've got recon troops coming down from the north. And also just infantry. So, I think we'll be fine. Uh, looks like they're going to have to come over this bridge area here, so that is a good place to defend. So we'll put you guys there, put you guys there, and we'll put you guys as a vanguard force. Actually, put you guys there. There we go, like that. And we'll keep you guys next to the place, just in case we need to move you around. So, how are you guys doing for fuel? You guys are still sucking for fuel, so... Do -do. Air patrol there. Yeah, this is the exciting part of the game, by the way. I say exciting, it's the slow part that you are probably going to shut off at and go, Oh, is this how we're going to be doing this shit for a while? I'm like, yes, we are. We're going to be doing this for ages. It's going to be beautiful. Right, you're getting fuel back. That's good. Tell you what, keep moving up. I want you to encounter that. Uh, yeah, there we go. How's that doing? How's that doing compared to our guys? It's not that bad, but we could do with a kind of a little bit of a speed up. So I'll tell you what, what we'll do is we'll, we'll send over... Make fox bats to do a raid. Go. Do a raid on that town. And we'll send the other four up to the north to harass the infantry coming down from the north as well. So there we go. And we've still got our whips on here, if you remember rightly. So doo -doo 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 -doo. we could just keep going further up the canal, Suez Canal, but I don't want to get too far ahead. Because if you notice here, they've actually got a port here. I don't really trust it because they're... actually, I'll tell you what I'll do. We've got more golf down here. I'll park that over there. Because yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna keep this area here over control, just in case uh, uh, this area here under my eye, because just in case they move things around here and start transporting them down and try and flank us over here, because that's where our army isn't, and that'd be dreadful if they got there. If they managed to surprise us. Oh, carriage, could you resupply these guys here? The carriage, could you resupply this guy here? Go on, you guys have done with that. So you do that, that, and that. There we go. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Right, to get these men infantry. There we go. Uh, look how much damage the big fox bats do. They're terrific. Such a fighting force has never been seen in Africa before. And we are the ones that are going to be showing them how great we are. Truly, we are an African nation worthy of the prowess. Okay, so let's put you guys back. Have we, have we captured an airfield further up yet? No, no we haven't. We'll put you guys back there. Okay, 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 right. You go up there and capture that uh, airbase. That airbase? That port over there. It's not an airbase. Unless we have flying ships. Mother of God, that'd be beautiful. No. Uh, what have we got? 
our barracks has been completed. Excellent, so now we can resupply from this area here. And hopefully we'll have more supplies coming in too. So that's good. I mean, we don't really have to steamroll Egypt as badly as I want to, but I like to. So I'm going to... Right, good, you guys go to there, you guys move up to there, and rocket artillery can move to there. And that'll cover us as well over the bridge. Okay, good, we've got our mountain infantry coming over. That'll be... we'll probably drop them... I'd say here. I like to think, just put them here. Actually, no, there. Put them on that bridge there, and that means that uh, we'll have them on a bridgehead, so they'll have to come over this bridge to actually come down and attack us, because they've got a railroad there, they've got no supplies here. There's just nothing, and we've also got our forces here, just in case they try anything. So, let's get you guys going. Right, once these guys get here, we'll move them over here. So, and air transport. Get them over there. And then we'll Good, we're just going to dump them right on top of the things there. There we go, capture that, they'll run out of supplies. And run away, there we go. And they'll try and get back over there, and boom, yes! We're doing well, guys. We're doing really well. Okay, so, next plan, beagles. We need you beagles to do a bombing run on this town here as the infantry come down. So there we go. Look at that, look at the damage that we're just doing to these guys. It's insane the amount of damage that we're doing. I mean, we just... <laughs> it's terrific. I shouldn't be glo uh, like reveling this much in the slaughter of people, but... Uh, what do you do? Right, so carriages, you guys, air patrol over here. The game does get a bit slow at this point, by the way, I'd like to point it. But, it's totally worth it considering the fact of, like, how much scope the game has, if you know what I mean. It's like it's got so much to it that you can just have fun with. Oh wait, they captured that area back! Bastards! Okay, good thing we still have these guys here. Move there and secure that, re-secure that thing over there. What was it called? It was just a mining complex, I think. Yeah, ore mines. They must have snuck down in the middle here. That's the problem with my guys at the moment, is we don't have enough... Um, supply... like, uh, recon units, so we can't actually just show them... Oh, there's the fucking... I knew it! See? I told you they would do that! And... Yep, they're completely ruining them. Great. So yeah, that's the reason we kept them there. So if we kept them just where they were, we would have just been stuck with uh, little bits of troops coming down. Not much of a hassle, but it's a pain because they'll just start taking little bits of territory. So that's the reason I'm doing that. I'll keep you guys moving. How are you guys doing for fuel? You're fine now. How about you go secure that area over there? Great. And yep, you're absolutely flattening them. So let's keep you guys moving to... actually, tell you what, send the whips out, let's see if we can see where these... I wonder if they've actually got a, a small recon troop or something like that, just running around in the fog of war. So let's have a look. Send out the whips. Nope, there's nothing else out there. Okay, so get you guys back to the carrier. There we go. And you guys can just keep moving up north. Go. Keep you guys moving. It's looking good, guys. The war is going well so far. Now let's, where are our ways? Our ways, we need our ways back. So let's get you guys, don't need the beagles. And don't need the carriages. We need the ways, there we go. So move you guys up to here. And we'll get you guys just moving the mountain infantry around. There we go, we're doing well. We're doing really well here. I think we'll have this war done in two parts, I reckon. I'm not going to edit these, like I said, so these are going to be you guys like seeing what's going to happen to all these other nations. There we go. Here come the merchant marines of Saudi Arabia. Yeah, that's fine. And they're turning back because they can't get through our territory anymore. That's the thing as well, is once we capture the Suez Canal Zone, uh, friendly units can... Oh, well, any unit can go through the Suez Canal Zone. But once we capture it, it's ours. So it's basically going to be our little way in and out of Africa. There's no way they can... Like the uh, troops can move in and out now of there. So, haha, ha, sucks to be them. Right, the only thing I'm worrying about is these guys might run out of supplies soon. So, we can't have these guys just kind of running rampant because, as you can see there, they've got 10 out of 16 left. So, it means they could probably hold it a little bit longer, but I don't really want to rely on them too heavily. So, let's get you guys moving up here, you guys up here, and we'll get the rocket artillery to sit behind there. And I can shell the shit out of everyone there. It's going to be glorious, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely glorious. And I don't know why they actually have the road going up here, so... I'm going to build... a road. That leads to there. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Beautiful road that doesn't connect up. Why doesn't it connect up? Come on. You can't do this to me. Come on! Ah, fuck you. Right. 
So now we've got our... Uh, yeah. We've got all these things, we've got this stuff done. It's great. We're doing well, watch this, right? When this infantry guy steps on this little bit of territory, it's going to be a massacre. <laughs> and dead. Did you hear that? Did you hear the glorious roar of rocket artillery there? Because I certainly fucking did. Right, we're going to get you guys to air patrol over here now. Yes, there. And we'll get you guys to air patrol over here and keep these guys supplied. Oh. Now, how are we doing against these heavy tanks? Pretty well, actually. Yep, we're doing well against the heavy tanks. I'm, I'm, I'm surprised, actually. I, I didn't think we were going to be doing too well against that kind of stuff. Oh, it's running away. Tell you what, we'll send the MiGs after him. Where did I put those MiGs? You ever get the feel, you ever get those days when you just lose MiGs? I do. Right, there you go. You go there. And make sure that guy doesn't want to escape. Yeah, see, that's the reason I only sent that one guy after here. Because the garrison forces will be shelled from the coast with um, by our ships. So we don't need to worry about them at all. So there we go. There we go. You guys can just deal with that. Okay, dokey. Right, so you MiGs have dealt with that. You get back to base. Okay. Let's take stock of how the war's gone so far. We've taken a nice swathe of land here. So I don't think we need to really worry about Egypt making any possible attacks against us because it doesn't look like they actually have an army anymore. I thought they had a good army. If I wasn't that worried, if I didn't know the, uh, if I didn't know they had uh, such a shit army, I would have invaded fucking ages ago. But never mind. Sorry, I'm just checking the space race. That's one thing as well. See, when you start going to war and you just kind of slow down a little bit, you'll be sitting here going, uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm just taking my time. I'm just clear war until I it's fine. Research will not come up at all. Oh wait, no, in the next three days we'll have commercial satellites. Woo! Right. Let's continue. Where are we going to go next? I reckon we should move these guys, these forward advanced troops, over to there. Yeah, they can hold there until we move back. So there we go. I'll tell you what, you guys, you guys got fuel? We sure shit do. Right, move up there. Move up there. And you guys move into the desert. You guys, I'll tell you what, move there. Desert, desert. And how are you guys doing against the garrison forces? You're doing fine against the garrison forces, excellent. Right, you guys get stuck in there. Yep, you hear that? You hear that bluish roar of artillery? I love that noise. That's just the noise of you're dead. You're hot. So there we go. Get stuck in, lads. Go, 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 go. And there, and and there. Go, 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 go. Right, we can't overextend ourselves, because as you can see here, we've not got any supplies here, so we'll have that territory just kind of soaked up after, so we can't move until we've got our supplies replenished. Otherwise, we'll get outflanked and die, so that'd be dreadful. Uh, one, two, three, four, and you guys can move up there. You can help capture that territory, because that guy there isn't doing that good job. Right, and they're losing supply here, so slowly this little bulge here will be eaten up. Uh, we've actually still got troops over here, which is good. We've got plenty of reserves, so... Uh, we'll move the reserves up, actually. Move you guys. You guys go to... there, and... Do -do 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 there. there so just in case we get any other, like, of their friends declaring war on us, we'll have plenty of guys in reserve. So yeah. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's a beautiful war, it's a beautiful day, we're going to destroy the Egyptians, uh, hey! <laughs> Right, come on. Stuck in once we take that port. Brilliant. Now that'll start giving us supplies. And that's a good thing because it means that we'll be able to take over their territory quicker. And that's good. That's good. Right. Next, 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 next targets. Next targets, next targets. We are going to move forward. Forward, forward, forward. Tell you what, you go up here and capture that bit there. And you move into the desert here and capture that. And you guys do the same, but over here, and I'll give you air supply with my carriages, so... There we go. Right, carriages, you guys... Air patrol to here. And you guys go back to base. And air supply from elsewhere. I'll show you in a minute. Elsewhere? No, we're not going to go to Cyrodiil. Air supply, there we go. Okay, this is going really well. This is going surprisingly well. I am pleasantly surprised by how little 
action the guys have. Oh, commercial satellites! Woo! Yay, we got our first bit of uh, orbital docking. I wonder if we can just get by that off the Soviet Union now. Tilt pod engines? No. Stealth aircraft? No. Where the flying family? Oh, there we go. Orbital docking. Can't be traded. Balls. Well, we're going to get orbital docking done next. And that is going to be beautiful! Oh, wow, our trade is sh Whoa, what has happened to our trade? Are we importing tons of... What the f Right, what is happening, guys? Is it our military? Oh, God, it's our industrial... Oh, right, that's because we're repairing all this stuff. Ah, well, it won't last that long, so... Once it's got all repaired, it'll be fine. We're gonna... Oh, fuck, that's a thought, actually. We're gonna have... Uh supply problems, especially once we take over all this territory. I mean, it's going to be great, we're going to have all this agriculture and stuff like that, but we are going to need to repair everything that we conquer. So our industrial goods is going to be a bit of a downer for now. Ah, fuck it, we could just sell technology to the Americans or to the British or something like that and just get our money back that way. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. It'll be just ballet fine. Right, have we got another airfield that's closer? Because right now we're just kind of sitting here going back and forth from there. Where's the nearest airbase? Where's the nearest? There we go. That'll do for our next target. We'll try and get up for there, or there. So yeah, that's quite a nice target. And the thing is as well is, uh, we don't need to worry about the... See how the supply zone... I'm pointing at the screen, I don't know why I'm pointing at the screen. But it doesn't encroach against cities, so if you've captured the city, you're, you'll own the supply zone around it. Until you run out of supplies in that city, and then it'll just be that one little bit you have. Uh, but if we have a line of them like this, it won't be able to go over the line. So anything beyond here will still remain as ours. So we can probably just capture this entire line of cities and we'll still be fine for, uh, what do you call it, supply. So yeah, we just need to, let's get our, let's get the finger out and get our, get our invasion heads on. Let's do this guys, come on, let's do this. Let's invade some countries, some cunt trace. <laughs> See what I did there? Right, there we go, garrison forces are being crushed by our mighty army. Our mighty army of Ethiopian men and women. We are crushing the resistance. No bother at all. Right. You guys on the move as well. I'll tell you what, you guys can capture the airbase. How about that for a fucking game of soldiers? There we go. Get stuck in, lads. You guys keep going up. There we go. Keep traveling. Keep traversing north. And we'll take this territory for the glory of Ethiopia. And the glory of King Cage. Praise be his name. Oh. Oh. Oh god, you guys didn't actually go all the way. Balls. Right, sit there. And sit there. Do, 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 do. There we go. Sit there. And don't move. I will get car send carriages to you. God, fucking damn these things. Right, what are we doing now? We've captured all this territory. And. Okay, that's encroaching on us here, but it's only because they've got a big chunk of supply here, so we just need to cut that out with them. Sorry, there's not much comedy in this one. I'm just kind of going. Let's do this and that and the next thing, right? So you gotta go there and you, because I want to, I want to make Ethiopia great in this game. I mean, this is, I'm fully invested in this now. I just want to make this the most ridiculous game I've ever seen of fucking Supreme Lord Cold War. Because quite frankly, it is ridiculous how well we're doing with this. It shouldn't be going this well, but it is. So I'm pleasantly surprised. Uh, keep moving forward. Oh, wait, wait, get back there. There we go, we're sending our infantry in against them again, and we've taken that place. Right, we're gonna have to, yeah, we're gonna have to tinker with our economy a little bit more once we're done with this invasion, because uh, as it stands just now, we are probably gonna have a lot of uh, agriculture to export, but we're gonna have problems in the sense that they only use petrol power stations. So we're gonna need more oil, we're gonna need probably more coal, we're gonna need everything. It's gonna be the post war world where we need to figure out what the hell we're doing. Okay, right, okay, so we've got guys coming in here, and here, and here... Got loads of people everywhere! Right. Carriages are doing the thing, I don't even think they can get to them. Nope, they don't, they can't. Okay, so you guys are just gonna have to wait for supply right now. Because our carriages can't go that far, so I'll tell you what, you just stay there. Right! What's that fucking noise? Why are people making such a racket? Stop making such a ruckus! Yeah, their garrison forces have run out of supplies, so it means that we can easily crush them. But the thing is, is that uh, it's a bit buggy because I can't 
can't really explain it. I don't really know how to explain why this is a little bit buggy, but see when the garrison forces appear, if they run out of supplies, they disappear again until one of your troops goes onto this. And then you waste all your supplies uh, trying to capture the city, and then they all have, they just, all, like, if you've got initiative on, they just automatically retreat to a safe location. But you're like, what are you retreating for? You, you won. <laughs> you've essentially won. I think we've nearly won, actually. We just need to take the Suez Canal zone, and that's it. Let's get in there. Oh, bollocks. These guys are nearly out of supply, too. Right. Do, 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 do. We're going to take the, the... Let's move you guys over here. Yes, that's what we'll do. We'll just take the bloody Suez Canal zone now. Let's get stuck in, lads. Let's go. Send these craft up to just take the Suez Canal zone for a little. There we go. Stuck in. Glorious, guys. Glorious. No, 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 no. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, you sack of shit. Yep. Yep. Oh, the fucking... Wow, they've actually sent in um, aircraft against us. Okay. We'll, we'll fucking sort that shit now. Uh, where are our... Oh, wow, we're still down here. I'll tell you what. You guys here... Keep moving up. Uh, well, well, we can't, actually, because we're no, not in a fucking space in, this, in the Suez Canal. Right, you... Move up here. And tell you what, you guys just stay there. Because they've got plenty of support, um, support craft here. But we need to get in here and take and uh, aid our comrades here. So, tell you what, you park off the coast of the capital. There we go. Don't know where you guys think you're bloody well going. Just you stay where you fucking are. Are the ways resupplied? Yes, they are. Right. Let's get you guys over there. Get over there. Get stuck in. Come on. Get that shit going. Look at them. Bastards. And drop them. Yeah. Yeah, we took the capital. Right. Now, we are going to start... Oh, wow, they're actually making a move to take us out. <gasps> I'm shocked and appalled. <laughs> right. Where are we going now? 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 Someone tell me where we're going now. Come on, guys. I can't do everything myself. Right. Let's move you guys further into the Suez Canal. We'll put you there. And you guys can just move around now at your own... The Lazurae and take that capital there. There we go. You guys move up there. What the fuck are you doing? Come on, what are you doing? Come on, what are you doing? Take that bit there. What are you t Guys, what the fuck was that noise? I don't even know what that was. Oh, it was one of them. What the fuck is that? Sterling B Mark III. I don't know what it is, but it just made a sound of a vibrating phone. It's like, what are we up against here, uh, Commander? Sir, they've got mobile phones. <laughs> right. We're gonna have to send our whip, 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 whip. I don't know why I started rapping there, but fuck it. There we go. No, what are you doing? Right. Whip, 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 whip. There we go. Get stuck in. Go kill some stuff. <laughs> Die, motherfucker. Right, you guys get back to where you're meant to be, and you just fuck off. I'm gonna just not bother with helicopters until I get better ones, because quite frankly, they're just taking the piss. Right. Do, 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 oh, by the way, before you ask, the reason I want to take the Suez Canal Zone before I do anything else is because it'll just sit there as a colony of mine, even if it doesn't have any cities. If it just sits there with one little bit there, it'll annoy me, and I'll just have to release it and then get really bad rap for take for invading a territory that belongs to me and it'll be really sad and I'll cry and I'll be like, ooh, but yeah. I'm talking crap. Help me! Right, there we go, there we go, right, you get back in there. What the fuck is that noise? Seriously, what is that noise? Is it one of these? I don't even know what it is, I don't care. Right. Are you guys done yet? Right, get in there. Go. You can do it. I believe in you. I believe in the heart of the cards. Come on. Are we going to lose our mountain infantry just because of the fact that these ways are shite? I'm going to sell them into another country eventually. Hey, hey, Brazil, do you want some way, way, way? <laughs> right. Let's get you guys moving, come on. We're nearing the capital. I love that noise. I don't know what it is, but I love it. Right, where are we now? You guys, tell you what, you guys keep moving up. The Suez Canal Zone. See, that's the thing, is these guys cannot take... Oh, wow, they're... We're lagging like nothing can happen. Tell you what, and you guys keep moving up to... There. Just capture that territory. Nope. 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 Capture that territory there. 
go. You move up there, and kadoosh. There we go. And we'll send more stuff up after that. What the? F where the fuck are my helicopters? And they're still carrying mountain infantry. Great. Get stuck into the capital. There we go. We're taking the capital now, guys. This is going to be good. Oh my god, this is great. Oh man, guys, we're doing so bloody well here. Right, let's sit there. Take out their, we took their capital. shitty shits. Oh my god, we're actually doing it. We're doing. We're going to do this in one feckin' episode. Now, this, this is hilarious. We're flattening them. It's happening, guys. It's happening. Have you not... Have you not got any fuel or supplies? Why are you trying to take territory, you knobs? Not taking that? Yes. Yes, we have. There we go. Brilliant. This is where the fighting is really going to get tough, because... Oh, they've got too many cities for me to handle. Right. Uh, you guys get up there and go help your friends over... Um, there. Right. Get stuck in. Go. Right. What are you doing? Get moving. There we go. And you guys take that place over there. there we go. It's a bit of a mess right now, actually. You know what? It's just a little bit of a mess. Okay, 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 okay. You move in there. And you guys get stuck in there. Let these guys take this bit of territory. Okay. Carriages, 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 carriages. Where are your carriages? There you are. Take the beagles up too. And you guys can go sit on here. And the Migs can do something else. Wait, where where's a where's an airbase that you guys can have for now? Is there is there one nearby? Oh there's one! There you go, you sit there. And to supply air support to our nearby guys. Wait, oh have they run out of supplies? Yes they have. Great. Okay, now we're gonna have to sit and wait for our uh, guys to get fuel back and stuff like that because if we don't have any supplies we can't capture territory that's a problem that we guys have right brilliant the garrison forces are running out of tr oh, oh we've run out of supplies here balls we have okay that's a problem that's a problem that's a problem but we can deal with that by going Doosh. if our ways behave will our ways behave do you reckon we yes if i can do Right, we took the capital in this place. Now we're going to move on to somewhere else. Somewhere else. See, this is going to be the problem as well with this episode. I just remembered that they've got Jerusalem up here. Well, not Jerusalem, that's fucking, what do you call it? Jordan's territory. Palestine, that's one. Uh, so we, we don't have to worry about that just now. Look at that! Our, the first Ethiopian ships have made their way through to the Mediterranean. Our first little... We did it. It's the Suez Canal zone. Annex. There we go. The Suez Canal is now under our control. Terrific. Now, no troops can get through to the other side of them. Can, no one can use the, uh, the Suez Canal no zone now. Is that awesome? Do fucking right, it's awesome. Right, okay, now let's move you guys up into the Suez Canal to show that it is fucking ours. It's ours. It's all ours. But yeah, I reckon, guys, I'm going to save the, uh, the final conquest of Egypt for the next part. Because, well, I don't want it to be over too quickly. So yeah, thanks for watching guys, and I will see you all very soon in the next part for where we'll crush Egypt under our heels. So yeah, see you later guys. Ta-ra!